Well, you never quite know what's going to happen in this all-London fixture. West Ham United against Chelsea here at the London Stadium. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting next to me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. Stuart, former West Ham player, of course. What should we be expecting today? Well, if West Ham play at their very best and close Chelsea down and stop them playing, they could cause an upset here today. They're a good team when they're playing at home. This could be a really tight game. And the starting lineup for West Ham United. The experienced Lukasz Fabianski stands between the posts. Kurt Zuma plays with Angelo Ogbonna in central defence. And the striker today is Mikel Antonio. Still trying to make something happen. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Well, he had to read it and get there, and did. Thiago Silva. Now with James. De Kate Delare. Attacking possibilities for Chelsea. Well, nothing productive, really. Flynn Downs Antonio back to Paqueta oh what an opportunity well last line of defence literally Mikhailo Mudrik Can they nudge in front? No problems grabbing hold of that one. Downs. Paqueta. In possession, Bowen. Flynn Downs. And West Ham in a position of menace. No possibilities inside the box. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Jared Bowen. And would be a bit annoyed to have lost the ball. Well, he prevented it from going over the line. Good vision. Can he get onto this? Just cleared away in the nick of time. Well, those stats tell you everything. A tight and cagey game without enough goal mouth action. Both teams need to get more players forward if they're to pose a real threat. And an astute piece of defending. Jackson on the ball. And West Ham did well to win the ball back. So far. In possession, Bowen. Vladimir so far. Not showing good patience. Paqueta. Well read to ease the pressure. Mudrik. The Kate Delare. And the referee's whistle, that will be all for the first 45 here in East London. And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched.
Very quick thinking there. Chilwell. And players waiting in the centre. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. And a goal to give them the lead. They have their reward. Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. And the Hammers get the ball moving again. Will there be a quick reply from them? There needs to be. Oh, this is looking promising. Well, danger averted thanks to his teammate. That's very effective. Good high pressing. Chilwell. Ryan Grafenberg. This attack looks highly promising. Chance to finish. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Said Ben Rama. Now with Paqueta. Not showing good defensive judgment. Noni Madueke. Ryan Grafenberg. Did well to win the ball back. Twenty minutes to go. Antonio. Paqueta. Well, the supporters think it's on. Struggling to keep the ball. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. So check. Antonio, real chance. And how about that for a save? And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. So the corner played into the box. It comes to absolutely nothing. And they'll be happy to have regained possession. Well, almost at the end of the game now, it's been a fascinating contest and it's Chelsea with a very narrow advantage. Stuart, what have you made of their performance? Well, they need to hold on here. Not long left now, but you have to say they've defended really well up to this point and I just can't see them conceding now. This will be a really good win if it stays like this. And with play stop, they will make the change now. Not the best clearance. Chilwell. And space for him to cut in. And a goal it is! But offside is the verdict. Well, it's a good finish, but he was just offside. Great decision by the assistant. Well, they've decided to make a change. Five minutes left. On Bonner. On the ball in an attacking position, but they've got to do something positive quickly. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw in. Well, this game is far from over. They'll probably get one more big chance before the end. The crowd certainly thinks so. Just listen to that noise. An alert piece of defending. Well, totalling up all the stoppages, we'll have two additional minutes. Shot attempted. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. 
A corner kick, and who knows, this might represent their last chance to grab an equaliser. So the final whistle, and what we can say officially now is that Chelsea have picked up maximum points from this fixture. Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team, and they deserve their victory. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance, hasn't he, Stuart? Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance...